what is up you all and today we're gonna be doing an $800 PC budget build guide for you gamers out there so if I'm going now to a computer store and I'm a gamer I have an $800 budget I want to play at 1080p at 120 frames per second at high settings for most of the games out there this build will be perfect for you now let's hit it off with the CPU starting off with the Ryzen 3 3100 it has four cores eight threads and it is bang for the buck for this build if you ask me because of the price per performance ratio of this CPU aside from its performance it is also built in with the Wraith Stealth cooler that is a very good cooler in my opinion I'm using one right now I didn't change my cooler from my previous build the 2700 build that I use uh, in all my games and my productivity you can also do streaming you can also do other productivity tasks but the main focus of this rig is gaming next we'll go with the motherboard now the motherboard that i am going for this one is the msi b450 tomahawk matx motherboard at 129 dollars this motherboard is a solid pick for this build because of its i like i really like the color scheme of the msi tomahawk series and also the reliability that it has and also the availability msi tomahawk is available on most for it, for example for me i live in the uae i'm uae based so the msi tomahawk is quite popular and is quite abundant in this region so i don't know with you guys but for, for me this is what i would recommend also it has native support out of the box for ryzen 3000 series so take note of that guys because other b450 boards need a BIOS update before it can cater a Ryzen 3000 series but for this board it is out of the box straight away Ryzen 3000 series compatible next is the memory so for this memory you can't go wrong with the crucial ballistics 8 by 2 that means two pieces at 8 GB each crucial ballistics CL16 memory as for the storage, we'll go with the crucial P1 NVMe SSD M.2 Hi, storage. <laughs> That's a lot of letters, but <laughs> but you can't go <laughs> but you can't go wrong with an SSD M.2 with this kind of build. If you need additional storage, then you can buy additional HDDs, SSDs, but for my recommendation, an SSD M.2 is the go for or the go to in this kind of build now going with the video card which will be the heart of this build because it is a gaming pc i would recommend the rx yes i'm going with team red here rx 5600 xt this is a 6 gb gpu card that will suit or that is for the performance is and I, I in my opinion bang for your buck because this trumps the 1660 super and the 1660 ti in most of the games right now for performance and for more fps for around 290 usd example imagine 290 usd for 120 fps nowadays it's so good compared to the compared to before for the case you can go with any case you want as long as it's around 60 uh, i think around 50 to 100 dollars but for this particular build i'm going to recommend the thermaltake s300 for 65 bucks you can't go wrong with this case you can fit all your motherboard gpus all your peripherals or i mean all your all your pc components seamlessly with this case so but you can choose other case but for me i would take this if i'm going to buy ram for the power supply i'm gonna go with an 80 plus bronze rating power supply for proper power delivery to our components and i'm gonna go with the seasonic s1 
12 or S12 3 I guess at 650 watts so it's just 65 bucks you can't go wrong with this Seasonic brand power supply because I've I've, I've used one on uh, other builds and they work fine they work great and also this doesn't have the spaghetti cables that we have it's all black and you can sleeve it no problem but the downside of this uh, power supply is that it is non-modular so you will be keeping the other wires inside your computer case but hey no problem with that right as long as it's reliable it's safe it delivers power to our components properly and 650 watts is a good threshold for this kind of build so that's it for this $800 PC budget kit. I hope you like the choices that we had for you for this video. Hit like and subscribe if you like this video and please support us by liking this video and subscribing to our channel. It will be a big plus and help for us and see you on the next one.